we're all data scientists now. We're actually all being expected to have conversations around data and experiences and engagement that previously had been kind of siloed within our organizations, but no longer. And just because we're all data scientists now, it'd be helpful to just quickly represent how data scientists work, right? This iterative cycle where you're going from identifying data to preparing it to constructing hypotheses and evaluating the results of that work and then deploying a test and then seeing the results of the test. That's, these are exactly the types of principles that data scientists use and that we're now being expected to apply to entire organizations. So you have people, you know, folks like Bain saying, well, an entire company should operate in this way. But the gap is that we didn't go to school for that. Right? In a lot of these frontline companies, people that are in sales roles and service roles, many of them didn't go to college. They're still, they don't necessarily have training in analytical thinking, analytical writing. And there's a real gap in building out data-driven decision making in a lot of companies where you're trying to use you know, the new associate app that rolls up data on the relationship you have with each customer, but these are not folks who understand how to use the statistics. And as marketers, a lot of our role ends up becoming evangelism, education um, of our entire companies on how these experiences are supposed to play out. 